David Spark reporting for the CISO series. I am here at Black Hat 2019 in Las Vegas, and there are a lot of security vendors behind me. Surprise, surprise, they are all trying to convince people that their solution is going to secure some specific aspect of their environment. Well, all of them have to adhere to one basic concept. And you know what? Not everybody agrees what that is. What does trust mean to you in security? Never trust anyone. I don't trust anybody. Trust no one. <laughs> I'm not a good person. <laughs> trust but verify. You have to verify. We'll allow you in, but we're also going to check. How do you know that someone who's logging into your system is actually who they say they are? Your adversary, the first thing they're trying to do is actually look like someone who you know. You really have no idea who those, those bad actors are. So until I know who you are and what you're doing, you're not doing it. What does trust in security mean to you? Trust is about people, and trust is about relationships. Relationship building, whether that be vendor to vendor or business to vendor. I've met you, I've shaken your hand. I that you're working with a partner that has your best interest in mind. They're not gonna try to basically pull a fast one on me. If you wouldn't want something to be done to you, then you shouldn't be doing that to somebody else. Trust means giving people what they want just because they want it. No, it doesn't at all. Sometimes it means transparency. Understanding how your data is being used, what it's being used for, and I hope you would, you know, keep me secure and make me... I hope you would. That's not trust. You don't want hope. You know, I think trust has to be earned. Building trust means evidence. It means assurance. And it takes a long time to develop that. And it's so easily lost as well. At some point, you've got to trust somebody, right? This person's ahead of my security. I've got to trust them implicitly. You've got to stagger it down at that point. The people under them give them less rights, less access, the people below them even more. And it also means an evolving ecosystem that's changing with the times. I always say it's about training and knowledge. If you have the proper amount of education, then you're naturally going to know what things you need to trust and what things you don't need to trust. Trust is not easy. You're going to have to have multiple departments and teams involved. You know, and everybody has to agree on what trust is going to be for the business. And I can guarantee you each business is going to do it differently. 